Understanding Mitochondrial DNA, a guide to our cellular powerhouses. Hello everyone, today, we're diving into the fascinating world of genetics, specifically focusing on mitochondrial DNA. This topic is not only intriguing for those interested in biology but also crucial for understanding human ancestry and health. So, let's explore what mitochondrial DNA is and why it's so important. Before we delve into mitochondrial DNA, it's essential to understand what DNA is. DNA, or deoxyribonucleic acid, is the molecule that carries the genetic instructions used in growth, development, functioning, and reproduction of all known living organisms. It's like a blueprint or a recipe for the organism. Cells are the basic building blocks of all living things. In each cell, there are various components, with the nucleus being one of the most important. The nucleus contains the majority of our DNA. However, there's another type of DNA located outside the nucleus, which is what we call mitochondrial DNA. Mitochondrial DNA, mtDNA, is the small circular chromosome found inside mitochondria. These mitochondria are often referred to as the powerhouses of the cell because they generate most of the cell's supply of adenosine triphosphate, ATP, used as a source of chemical energy. Unlike most of our DNA, which comes from both parents, mitochondrial DNA is inherited only from the mother. Mitochondrial DNA is crucial for several reasons. 1. Energy production. It plays a key role in cellular energy production. 2. Disease research. Changes in mitochondrial DNA can cause genetic disorders. 3. Ancestry tracking. It helps in tracing maternal lineage and understanding human evolution. Mutations in mitochondrial DNA can lead to a range of genetic disorders, often affecting organs with high energy demands like the brain and muscles. Understanding these mutations helps in diagnosing and potentially treating such conditions. I hope this video has shed some light on the intriguing world of mitochondrial DNA and its importance in our cells, health, and ancestry. It's amazing how much we can learn from such a small part of our cells. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found this informative and engaging. Stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of genetics.